Hi guys, good morning. I am three days postpartum today and I'm just laying here or just sitting here in bed. Um, my husband has laundry going, just took out the trash, all that good stuff. So letting him handle the household chores, which feels amazing because I'm like, you need to step in, you do everything. Um, I probably look crazy. We just woke up a couple hours ago. I still have tape on me. I've been trying to get it off. And it looks gross. I know. I need to get in the shower and scrub it off. Um, but yeah, three days postpartum. They let us out 24 hours after baby girl was born. Um, so we're home. I finally gave her her first bath, sponge bath. So I'll flip the camera here in a minute and show you guys. But my lips have been really, really chapped. I think I went through this a lot during my pregnancy is also getting really chapped lips but we are here my belly i'll have to show you guys in a little bit what it looks like but i have been wearing my um belly wrap so i'll show you guys that in a few as well so i just gave her a sponge bath she is nice and cozy i just put on a little um newborn onesie it fits her perfectly a lot of the other onesies weren't fitting her they were too big um so i found the newborn ones and went ahead and put it on her her hair looks nice and fresh it was getting really really oily she has not had a bath since she came out so i didn't even have them give her a bath at the hospital i wanted to do it myself um so oh, there's a piece of lint um so yeah this is our little princess she's just enjoying being home right now is nap time she was awake with me the entire time i was giving her a bath a baby girl was awake the entire time i was giving her a bath and that was pretty much her little wake window she was up for about an hour with me we were just talking and then i gave her a little sponge bath here in the room because it's nice and warm um so I, w I wanted to give her a sponge bath here in the room because I have everything in here that I needed and that sure not to get her little umbilical cord um, wet or anything. Uh, so yeah, and then she had her first doctor appointment yesterday at two days. Um, so we went to that, everything went really well. She lost some weight, so doctor was a little concerned. We go back in to her doctor appointment on Friday. We have another doctor appointment, I should say, on Friday doctor wants to make sure her weight is slowly um or gradually going up so that was their main concern because she lost a pound it was just the whole labor experience she was stressed out but she's doing really good we're home i'm so glad we're home it's been a couple days that we've been home now but every time every day i wake up i'm like thank goodness i'm not at the hospital you know because they wanted to keep us two days but we ended up just staying one which was nice um, but yeah, let me show you guys what my little belly looks like. Alright, just to show you guys, this is three days post baby. And it's slowly going down. Um, but that's what it looks like. I still have a really dark line. And if you guys remember, my belly button would stick out. Um, so that's starting to go in as well. But it does look a little bit round for the most part. So I'm going to show you guys how I put on my wrap. I like to put it on over my shirt because then it gets all, like it touches my skin and I don't like that. So pretty much what I do is I do the first one in the center like so and then tighten these how I want. And then the second one, there's actually three parts to it, but I only use two. Whoops. Like so. So that is what, don't mind my pointy boobs, but that is how I put it on and then as the days go by as my stomach starts to get smaller I'll tighten it even more because it does tighten pretty good like you can get it really 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 tight and then it'll give you like a figure but I'm not gonna do all that right now 
All right guys, so I am four days post baby. This is what my belly is looking like. It's starting to go down a lot more. It was more flabby yesterday and the day before, um, but it does feel like a little firm still to the touch. I have been wearing my band more, so that's hopefully going to help. Um, I do have a really dark line still, and then my milk is starting to come in, and hence why my boobs are like ginormous right now. I finally felt it come in. For these past couple days, I haven't been feeling it come in. I've just been feeling that they were full, but I finally feel it and they're starting to get hard, especially when baby girl doesn't eat right away. They just feel really, really like rock hard. Um, but I'm going to feed her right now, but I wanted to do a little update real quick to show you guys what my belly is looking like. I do look like I still have a little bit of a pregnant belly. It doesn't look as loose and flabby like it was a couple days ago. Um, so I'm actually really liking the way that the band's working. I think after this, I'll probably go on a walk do a little bit of light walking with baby girl and my son just to get out of the house um start walking a little bit more because i know i noticed my feet are starting to hurt and um i don't want to get like blood blood clots or anything like that i have been wearing compression socks since i got home um so i know that's been helping a little bit more as well but i just don't want to be lazy around the house you know i've been um, doing light things around here like folding laundry and all that stuff but everything else my my husband's been doing for me which I absolutely love but it is belly for day four you guys I feel like slowly it's starting to go down I can also honestly pull off being pregnant right now <laughs> just like that all right yeah pretty much <laughs> but we will see this belly slowly start to go down um, i'm sure it's going to take a couple weeks but that's what i'm looking like for today i'm going to get ready to go for a walk with the babies i'm going to put my band on right now but yeah that's today's update hi guys so i am six days post baby i just got done laying down for a little bit i was laying down with baby girl um she just got done eating and i actually took like a little snooze like a 20 minute snooze I was a little exhausted, so took advantage of her napping, and the kids are outside with my husband. He let us have some quiet time, so I love when he just takes over, and I don't have to tell him anything. I don't know why I look a little bit more chubbier. Maybe it's because I've been eating a lot more, especially since we got home. I feel like I'm always snacking and always eating. Breastfeeding definitely um, is quite a journey, but I am going to stick through it all. Um, because I love breastfeeding my babies and I'm hoping to breastfeed baby girl for a year like I have done with the rest of my babies in my face I do look a bit more not swollen but I do look a little bit more my mom my mom saw me today and she's like you look really healthy I was like oh thanks mom um but yeah this is six days post baby and I wanted to show you guys my belly real quick my comfy target pajamas this is just like a cover a boob cover I guess you can say but this is us at six days I can't tell if it went down or if it's still the same but I've, I don't if you can see the lines on my belly I've been wearing my belly band um, so like I said I feel like I do look a bit more chubbier not in my belly so much because my belly is gonna go down slowly but um, yeah this is six days post ba baby. I honestly, when I wear this, I feel like I still look super pregnant. <laughs> but yeah, six days post baby and I'm definitely enjoying it all. And I'm so excited to continue sharing my journey with you guys and all that good stuff. But yeah, I know these changes in pregnancy can come and you can either enjoy them or not enjoy them. But honestly, I enjoy having my belly getting back to normal and all that good stuff because honestly it's the journey that you've gone through that makes it all worth it and i'm so glad that i even got to get pregnant again and experience being pregnant and all that good stuff it's definitely a memorable experience and you never know i might do it again might have another one that's definitely up in the air as of right now no because we just had a baby and i just want to enjoy the special moments with our precious little girl that came into the world 
and I cannot believe she's already gonna be a week old tomorrow which is crazy to me I feel like it went by so fast but like I said I'm so glad I get to share this journey with you guys and experience everything all over again it's definitely a bittersweet feeling to know that I'm not pregnant again because I definitely miss my belly I definitely miss her kicking and all that good stuff but I'm also so happy that she's here which is a special feeling honestly and I look at her and I just I get so emotional because I'm like you know at one point we thought we almost gave up you know but so glad we didn't I'll stop chit chatting there I just wanted to say thank you guys all so much for watching and I will be posting more videos here but I just wanted to share my week with you guys and how it's been and how I've been doing and how my belly's been looking but so far this week has gone by so fast and I just wanted to document it all and show you guys what's been going on. But yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe and I'll see you guys all in my next one.